when Douglas Carter Bean first came in to explain this bizarre notion of doing a, an adaptation of Rodgers and Hammerstein's Cinderella with contemporary references, but also p making reference to the original Perot story, um, he said, he told me things about the original story that I never knew. Douglas Carter Bean has kind of gone through and completely gutted the book and made it into this really kind of snappy and fast, funny um, script. And he has been totally respectful of it, um, honors it every step of the way, but at the same time I think has totally reinvented it. He's very witty and clever and funny, and so it's still the classic romantic story that we all know and love with a couple kind of contemporary twists. What audiences will really appreciate it is that they can still hum the tunes and they, they still know the entire story, but it's just um, something that both children and adults can relate to. The, what I did was I went online, which is insane what you can find online. And I tried to bring up every version of Cinderella I could find. And there was one by Charles Perrault. And it was so simple and so pure, but so smart. His book is so, is so refreshing. And it's, uh, it's light, it's romantic, it's funny. And, um, and also it's the classic tale that somehow he sort of resurrected so that uh, kids and families and I say people, everybody can sort of enjoy Cinderella again. I think it's remarkable how he has taken a, a story that is universal to begin with and made it even more universal. If you think you know Cinderella, you're going to be surprised.